सो गाइज आर यू प्लानिंग टू सेल योर यूज कार और आर यू प्लानिंग टू बाय यूज कार इन दोज कंडीशन दिस वीडियो इज गोइंग टू बी अ वेरी यूजफुल वीडियो फॉर यू बिकॉज आई एम गोइंग टू टेल यू एग्जैक्टली वेन यू शुड बी रिपेंटिंग योर कार एंड वेन यू शुड नॉट बी रिपेंटिंग योर कार If you are planning to sell it, my name is Raisan, and I am an auto body and paint expert, author, and instructor. And welcome to Raisan Spray Booth. It is going to be a very interesting video, guys. So see that you like the video now only. And if you are coming on this channel for the first time, see that you subscribe and press that bell icon so that you will not miss any of my future videos. So come on, let's start the video. Welcome back. So guys, if you are planning to sell your used car, then should you repaint it or when you should repaint it? All those things I'm going to clear in this video, guys. So if you are somebody who wants to sell your used car, then comment below and let me know, guys. And let's see how many people are selling their used cars. Because in this video, guys, I'm going to give you seven points on which you can decide if you should repaint your car before selling or if you should not repaint your car if you are planning to sell it. So moving on to the first point guys and the first point is it depends on which car you are selling. Yes guys, some cars are always in demand and some cars are never in demand. Now which are the cars which are in demand all the time? The cars that give good mileage, the cars which are cheap on maintenance and the cars whose parts are easily available. Now these cars are fast moving cars guys and the cars which are not in demand will not give a good mileage. their parts will not be easily available and their maintenance cost is very very high guys so if you are planning to sell a car which is in high demand then if you repaint that car then it is going to increase the resale value of that car guys and you can charge a little bit extra on that but keep in mind that you will be repainting that car guys so it will come at a cost so while setting the rate of the car guys you should keep it after adding that cost which you have paid to paint the car but if you are selling a car which is not in demand first of all nobody is going to pay you that much for that car and guys even if you repaint it then nobody is going to give you that much of money because that car is not in demand in the first place so if you are selling a car which is not in demand then in my opinion you should not repaint that car because you will spend lot of money painting that car and you, the money that you will get will not even cover the cost of that paint job So moving on to the second point and the second point is it depends on what type of color your car is now here also guys there are some fast moving colors and some slow moving colors now if you guys are in buying and selling used car market then you should always stick to white silver or black color because these are fast moving colors guys and i have written all these things in my book i had written that book few years back but never sold it it is easily available on amazon and in that book guys i have mentioned every detail of how you can buy and sell your used car very easily and with all the tools and hacks i have mentioned in that book guys so if you want to buy that book then i will put a link of that book in the description below you can go there and check that book out it's a very interesting book guys and i had created it only for the indian market that is the reason why that book was not sold that much if i had created that book for the global market then for sure it would have been fast moving book so if you know how to read a book and if you are in a used car buying and selling market then go ahead and read that book as quickly as possible guys because on that you will come to know all the secrets of how to buy and sell your used car coming back to the color guys now not all people like vibrant colors like red orange blue most of the people try to avoid these colors and they are called as a slow moving colors whereas the silver white and black and the light colors are known as the fast moving colors now if you are planning to sell your used car which is in vibrant color and if you want to sell it fast then in my opinion you can repaint that car in white color when you repaint it in white color guys it will sell faster and it will also increase the resale value of that car now when you change the color of your car guys you, you will have to register it in the rto guys and you will have to get the new rc for it or you might have a tough time to sell your car so you will have to go through that hassle of registering your car again if you change the color on your car so keep that in mind as well moving on to the third point and the third point is if your car is rusting yes guys rusting is a big issue and the person who is coming to see the car 
if he sees the rust on your car he will reject that car right away it is such a big issue guys so if there is rust on your car you will have to repaint it and you'll have to do some body work on it guys because nobody is going to buy a car which is rusted because it shows the negligence of the owner it shows that the car was not maintained properly so you will have a tough time to sell this type of cars guys so if your car has rusting on it then see that you repaint it treat your car and then only you will get a good value on it so moving on to the fourth point and the fourth point is is the paint on your car faded completely yes guys if the paint on your car is faded completely like this then i suggest you to repaint your car because the person who is coming to buy the car if he sees the car like this which is faded completely then he'll step back guys he'll think about what his family members will say if i take home a car like this which is completely faded and which looks completely horrible so he will think that he will have to pay more money to repaint that car now so that is the reason why he will reject it right away so if you want to sell your car faster then you will have to repaint that car now guys if you know how to do your own paint job then now you can paint this car by yourself and when you paint this car by yourself you save money on your paint your clear coat you save money on the paint job and you can get the paint job done for very cheap guys and now you can maximize the profit but to paint your own car you should have the auto body and painting skills in the first place guys now you can learn auto body and painting very easily from home because i have created a step by step course on it i have explained everything in detail how to do your own paint jobs now the process is the same you just have to know the right process guys and when you do your paint job by yourself you can maximize the profit at a good limit guys so if you want to learn auto body and painting seriously then i've put a link of my course in the description below you can go there and get yourself enrolled and i will see you guys on the inside now after repainting that car your resale value will also increase guys you can repaint that car in the same color which is there on the car and as you repaint it guys your resale value will go higher and you can sell that car at a higher value because when your car is faded guys it leaves that first impression and if the first impression is not good then people will not buy your car moving on to the fifth point and the fifth point is how old your car is now guys if you are selling a car which is very old and if it has crossed 15 years then people will hesitate to buy that car guys but now you restore it you repaint it and you make it looking like new and when somebody comes to see that car he will feel that even the newer car which he saw were not in as good condition as this car so that will change his decision guys and he can buy that car so if it is a old car then my suggestion is you repaint that car and make it look like new moving on to the sixth point and the sixth point is guys if your car engine is good if it has less kilometers on it and if your car interior is good but if there are only tiny scratches and dents on the exterior of the exterior body of the car well in that case guys you don't have to repaint your car but if you know to do it by yourself then obviously you can do it it will increase the resale value obviously but in this case guys because your kilometers are low your engine is good your interior is also good then you can skip the exterior repainting you can still get a good value on it but if you do those paint jobs by yourself then you can increase your resale value more so that is the reason why i keep telling you guys learn auto body and painting and you can benefit a lot from it and with that let's move on to the seventh point and the seventh point is if your car has a big dent on it your door is gone inside your bonnet is gone inside in those cases guys you will have to do some body work on your car you will have to take out those dents and you will have to repaint those places because nobody will want to buy a car which has a big dent on it guys it will look as if it is a accidental car so if your car has a big dent on it i would suggest you to repaint it do the body work take the dent out and repaint that car and you can get good value on that car so guys if you are in the buying and selling used car market then see that you go and read my book and if you guys want to learn auto body and painting then go down below in the description and get yourself enrolled in my course and i will see you guys on the inside so those were the seven points guys on which you can decide if you want to repaint your car before selling if you found this video useful then see that you like and share with your friends and family and if you have not yet subscribed to my channel guys and see that you subscribe to my channel and press that bell icon so that you will not miss any of my future videos till then This is Rajasthan Finance signing out until we meet again. Oh, 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 oh,